with analysts Greg Anthony and Steve Smith, and we'll be hearing from T.A. along the sideline all game long. So the opening lineup for the Sun. Ring pairing, it's the scoring threats of Beal and Booker. Duran is out there with Nurkic, and it's Jones in at the point. And for the Lakers, down in the block, it's LeBron and Davis. At the guard positions, Russell and Reeves, and it's Hachimura in at the three slot. Well, both of these sides rebound the ball so well, Smitty. How does that impact the game? Kevin, this matchup is going to feel scrappy because both of these teams are used to controlling the backboard. They'll do everything they can do to gain that advantage tonight. It'll be Los Angeles off the tip. Here's Reeves. He's covered by Beal. From 12 feet out, it's good. Just the first good move in a game of chess between these two coaches. Strategy is going to be a big part of the outcome tonight. We'll see which team dictates the style of play. It's stolen by Hachimura. And the layup falls. And showing some toughness on that take. Hachimura, these kinds of buckets can energize a team. Now here's Jones. And Davis sends it back. Reeves the pass to James. Dishes to Davis. Puts one up from 19. Oh! And that's a rugged play. That one was big time. There was no doubt in AD's mind that he was going to score with that putback. Booker. Good work defensively by Hatchimer. What a defensive play. Gets the stop and does it without fouling. And now here comes Jones leading the break. And then Durant with the dunk. Something Jones does well, making smart passes to wide open guys. Here's Russell. And he uses the glass yeah, on the way. Setting the tone with an aggressive move to the rack. And, and where's the help defensively? No excuse. You have to be aware. He should be on your radar all the time. Now, here's Nurkic. And good that time. Nurkic. That hit on Nurkic, it wasn't enough for preventing him from scoring. He's such a strong player. Here's LeBron. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. It's on Kevin Durant. Lakers shooting their first free throw. First trip to the line in this one. And last season, 77% from the line. They could usually get the job done there. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. He misses the free throw. One of the greatest players of all time, and LeBron still adds to his game. And the second free throw, good. Here's Booker. If you're just tuning in, we played about two and a half minutes here in the first. Now the pass to Nurkic. He dishes it to Jones. Down to five on the shot clock. Doesn't get it to drop for him. LeBron with some nice deep. Katie against Russell. Pass to Reeves. Shoots over Beal. Beal with the block. And so the ball out of bounds. Beal touched it last. It remains Los Angeles ball. And in this first quarter, about three minutes played. And the officials are calling the illegal screen right there. Hey, guys, point of emphasis for the league is to really crack down on illegal screens. Yes, the last few years, the rules changes have tended to benefit the offenses. 
This evens things out a bit. And the Suns call their first time out of the game. Fantastic Laker Girls. Once again, your Laker Girls. The Suns trailed by five. Outside, Jones. Beal trying to break loose. And it's Russell with the rebound. Those are chances. Almost always you can rely on him to get you two points, but the deep just enough to keep him out of rhythm. I mean, any chance you get, you want to put yourself in a position to succeed, and that's what he did there. Great job of reading the floor, got to the rim, and made a play. Beal from long range. And again, it's the Suns missing. Not quite enough defense. That time around, just lucky he was off. Talking about Bradley Beal, Greg, I feel like he doesn't get enough credit for his passing game. You know, Kevin, he's really evolved as a playmaker over the years. Sure, we, we all know how talented a scorer and shooter he is, but Bradley is now superb at facilitating. Reeves gets the bucket. Using outstanding floor awareness there. Russell's ability to pick apart the defense and find the open man. Now here's Jones. Still scoreless. Beal finds Jones. Back to Beal to stop the drought. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. And you don't ever want to get into the habit of letting the offense get to the rim. And let's That's get your take, guys, on the scoring breakdown for the Lakers. Beal. Tonight, early on, this team is saying, forget the analytics. Let's take mid-range shots. They can be easy points. On top of that, they're creating turnovers and taking advantage by converting on the offensive end. The first free throw is good. And quite simply, Beal is an all-NBA player in our league, a multi-dimensional guard who does many things well, especially scoring the ball. That one misses, so he goes one for two. And it's Russell with the ball. He'll bring it up for the Lakers. Off target there. That would have pushed the lead to double digits. Down low. Here's Jones. And he takes it in for the layup off a very nice feed. Excellent concentration. Got to do more than this to keep Jones from scoring. Jones against Russell. There's the drive, and the slam dunk by Russell. Never a bad idea to run the old pick play. Uh-uh, you're right. And if it produces a slam like that, you'll probably see more of them. Especially if the defense is going to allow you to do it. Have to switch on that play. Hachimura against Booker. Nurkic with the block. When Nurkic blocks shots, you feel it. An impactful defender. No good on the triple. Definitely a situation you want to make sure you don't give him too good of a look. And it's Durant with the rebound. Suns trail by eight. Beal the pass to Booker. Sinks the triple. And textbook mechanics make it look like it's going in every time. Booker, unreal. Passes it to Hachimura. Shoots a fader. Offensive rebound. And it's sent back by KD. Launches it. That's good from yeah, Booker. Booker on the assist from Beal. Booker's got six points. And we continue to see Beal improve as a playmaker. Beautiful pass there. So timeout called here. The first for Los Angeles. Uh, let's see if coach can get them back on the right track because right now it feels like the pace is being dictated to them they need to go back to playing their brand of basketball russell this is to lebron Loads it up for Davis and finish it off by Davis. You won't find a much better alley oop partner. AD flying to the rim. Suns trail by four. Jones the pass to Beal. Back to Jones.
Just five to shoot. Right through the D for the layup. Tyus Jones doing a great job of breaking down the defense and the pick and roll, taking what they gave him. Outside, Russell. And he's good on the three ball. He has seven. And that pick takes the D totally out of the equation. Hey, if you're not going to fight over, you're essentially giving the shooter the look he wants. Here's Reeves. Davis, the pass to Reeves. Beal with the steal. Puts it up. And Davis pulls it down. Davis has got his fifth rebound in this one. Russell against Jones. Russell passes to LeBron. Nurkic with the block. And that'll be the Lakers as it goes out of bounds. Lakers retain possession. And Los Angeles with some changes. Vanderbilt's checked in for Rui Hachimura. And it's Gabe Vincent in for D'Angelo Russell. And then for Phoenix, Plumlee is checked in for Yusuf Nurkic. Akogi comes in for Jones. And Grayson Allen subbed in for Bradley Beal. LeBron shot is off. Uh, I'm honestly not sure what that was about. Maybe a protest against his coach? Or is he actually insane enough to think that he might be able to make that? Either way, we might see him sitting by himself for a while. Lakers leading by five. Over to the left wing. Here's Vincent, defended by Booker. The offensive rebound. And his pure defensive effort changed that shot from an easy one to a tough one. And you know, technically, it's a high percentage look. But this is why we play the game. Scooped up. Vanderbilt lays it up on the glass. And the Lakers lead by seven. And the D getting out work there on the putback. Can't let that happen. For some reason, blocking out has become a lost art, and that's the result you'll get. And the Suns call time. And just trying to get some traction offensively. It hasn't been pretty. You no, know, this is a good time to maybe switch up your strategy a little bit. You can't keep doing what you're doing and expect a different result. Enjoy. There's a Kogi. Scoreless thus far. Good on the three-point shot. How about that move? Is this guy special or what? Just love watching him operate inside. From deep LeBron. Headshot off. Suns trail by four. Inside. LeBron grabs the miss. LeBron's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Pass to Reeves. Floats one up. And yes, it's good. Reeves has got six points. Really well done there. Just confident and composed. Never in a hurry. Allen with the ball. Booker outside. There's a Kobe. Shot clock at five. Puts up a deep three. Kept alive. Booker's shot is good. He's got eight. And you know, defenses try to get physical with Booker. And now he's used to that. He just plays through the contact. Now, here's Vanderbilt. The pass to Reeves. It's not going to go for him. Great D that time from Durant. Over in the corner, Allen. Over Vincent. Allen shot is off. And so James will bring it up for Los Angeles. Four-point game. Vanderbilt finds Davis. It's a nice passing here by Los Angeles. Back to LeBron. Trying to get open is Davis, LeBron and LeBron gets it to go with the assist by Davis. Anthony Davis. And the Lakers lead by six. Oh, and there's the alley-oop. 
Plumlee, you know what? Well, that alley-oop attempt, a case of what could have been, just didn't finish the play. You know, this is something you practice over and over again. I'm surprised they couldn't execute. And the whistle blows as the basket counts and a three-point play chance right here. One for throw coming up. Tremendous body control. LeBron takes the hit, sinks the shot, Kevin now gets a chance to add another point That's to his total. This is his third free throw second attempt of the game. Five. And at the line last year, he was good on about 77% of his attempts. Boys and Eagles checked in for Phoenix. Morris comes in for Booker. Forty-one seconds left in the first quarter. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. Here's Morris. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. The Suns have gone one for two on the night so far from the line. Shooting for Phoenix. Monte Morris at the line for two. And he makes the first. He's perfect from the line this time. 30 seconds left to play in the first quarter. to Wood. There's the triple. Phoenix grabs the miss. Allen passes to Morris. Now Plumlee. And it's Mason Plumlee with the foul. That is his first foul of the game. Yeah, really good defensive play to cut him off there and square up. Second team foul. Just four seconds left to play in the first quarter. From deep. And the last second attempt does not go in for it. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers heading to the bench with a seven-point lead as we wrap up the quarter. And they've done a phenomenal job down low. So many of the points coming right at the rim. We'll return shortly. And thanks again for tuning in. If you're just joining us, we've played through one quarter of action so far. And taking a look at Los Angeles' performance here, what have they been doing or not doing? Stingy on the defensive end in that first quarter. They were just getting up into people. Yeah, they were very physical and very aggressive. They've just been the better team so far. Suns trail by seven. So at Durant sitting on the bench. This is who Frank Vogel is out there. Jones is out there with Booker. Then there's Nasir Little. Then there's Yusuf Nurkic. And it's O'Neal in it for the power forward. Jones finds Nurkic. That's his second shot and his second basket. He's two for two. This is Nurk in his office of comfort zone, tracking down a high percentage shot. Back to Russell. And Jones pulls it down. Phoenix has gone three of seven tonight from three-point territory. And a guy who's easy to trust, Smitty, running this offense, Tyus Jones. Kevin he is completely unselfish, Kevin. He makes smart plays out there. Knows when it's his time to score, and he's a second coach on the floor. Russell passes to Hayes. Here's Reeves. He kicks it to Russell. Shot clock at six. It's stolen by Jones. Here's Booker. And the dunk by Booker. Great to see Jones instigating the action, getting aggressive on D, and starting the break. Jones against Russell. And the ball travels out of bounds. It was last touched by Nurkic. It remains Los Angeles ball.
just about a minute and a half has gone by here in the second. Here's Reeves. Great defense by Booker. The That's instincts he has just always knows where to be. Oh, smooth. Guys, very good job getting himself in close enough that he could just tip it back in. Well said. Those kind of plays in the offensive glass can tell the story oh, sometimes, yeah. can't they? I'm not sure who was supposed to be on him that possession. I mean, apparently, neither did the defenders. Out left to the wing. Reeves the pass to Hayes. Here's Reeves, defended by Booker. Reeves can't hit. With a short break in the action, gives us a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge. Thank you all, guys. Kevin Durant is dedicated to his craft, of course, but he relishes his connections off the court as well. He says there's so much you can learn from being an NBA player. Life lessons in basketball, the business around the league. Every stop around the way is an experience for me to accelerate and be better in the next part of my life. Kevin? Well, that's a great perspective, isn't it? David, thank you so much. Uh, beyond the leaning, you could see his feet more set on that screen. Easy call. So difficult to stay planted, especially with all the motion around you. Annoying turnover. D2 for Russell. It's good. Only a few seconds into the shot clock. And it's a three-point Los Angeles lead. The Suns have gone a sensational 5 of 5 from the field since the start of the second quarter. Jones, the pass to Nurkic. Knocked away. When it comes to the essential components of a winning team, GA, how much importance do you place on veteran leadership? I think it's important. You want a few guys in the locker room who have seen it all. Players who can keep the ship steady if the team kind of goes awry or, or has a tough stretch. Free throw, good. Nurkic. A player like Nurkic is a good piece for any squad. They can rely on him to take care of business inside on both ends of the floor. That one is no good. For Los Angeles, they've gone 3-7 of seven shooting the ball here in the second quarter. And here's Russell. He's got nine. Oh, and he plucks it off the glass. Wow. Booker with no one around. And that Devin comes off Booker. the assist by Jones. Three. Booker's got the lead up to one now for the Suns. Time out, time out. And a breakdown here, guys. The hustle stance for the Suns. They are making a statement so far on the defensive end. Sending shots away in incredible fashion. Loving the hustle. And another thing they've done well is push the tempo. They're running the floor and converting on the fast break. Nurkic with the steal. And the points coming for them now, Greg and Bunches. And we're seeing what a high-octane offense should look like. Here's Jones. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. Jones has got 10 points in the game. Terrific execution and close. The defense can't give Jones these easy buckets. Kicks to Russell. Shoots. And the foul on Rui Hachimura. That is his first foul of the game. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. And here's Phoenix. They're on a 16-6 run. Booker looking around. Off target with his three. Lakers trailed by three. Outside, Russell. Passes to Reeves. Looking to get it going. Good, and it's All Russell three, picking up the assist. Four, Eight points for him. Great job Russell. executing the offense. That pass on time and on point. Jones against Russell. Booker outside. And there's the whistle. Three-second violation. Three violation. Anthony Davis is checked in for Hayes. 
Now into the lineup for your Lakers, Anthony Davis. Lakers have gotten a little under 50% of their second quarter shots to find the mark. Four of nine all told. <laughs> Defended by Little. And the rebound by Nurkic. Great defensive effort. Just saved a basket. You know what? This is why you never give up on a play. You don't know what's going to happen. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Hachimura's got four rebounds in this game. Also looking around. Pass to Hachimura. And he banks in the lane. Hachimura's got six. You have to push Hachimura out of there if you're the defense. He's a real problem on the interior. And the Suns call time. Welcome to the floor, the legendary, fantastic Lakers. Durant's check in for Nasir Little. Once again, you're a Laker girls dance team. Outside, Jones. It's stolen by Davis. Loads it up for Davis. Poked away. And what should have been a simple pass and finish Ends up in a missed opportunity on that alley-oop attempt. Yeah, it started off looking good, so but the timing was just a little off, and sometimes that's all it takes. Russell passes to Davis. Back to Russell. And he lobs it up toward the rim. A lot of give and take between these sides. And both teams look like they came to play. We should have a good one. Jones, the best to Nurkic. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. That one on Davis. Once Nurkic gets established, the D must foul him. Great work earning the whistle there. The Suns shooting their seventh and eighth attempts at the foul line tonight. Taking two shots. Free throw good, Nurkic. And both free throws good for Nurkic. And so it's Russell with it. He'll bring it up for the Lakers. And there's the pass to Reeves. Out to Russell. Five to shoot. Shoots it up. Here's Hachimura. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. And when Hachimura is looking to score, it sometimes forces the D to get aggressive. Love the energy. This is his first free throw of the game. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. So he gets them both. Phoenix has gotten fewer than half of their three-pointers to go down tonight. They're four for nine. Pass to Nurkic. Here's O'Neal. And the bucket is good. Three-point play Sounds chance good. here for him. Guys, what a wild Sounds first good. half this has been. A while back in fourth start, that's for sure. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the game here. 
So it's both teams making substitutions here. Lakers have gone 6 of 14 shooting here in the second. Here's LeBron, and he slams it down LeBron. right on top of Kevin Durant. Respect LeBron showing the artistry that other players could only dream of. Now here's Beal, guarded closely. No good on the shot. The Lakers in the lead. Passes it to Vanderbilt. Covered by Morris. The dish to LeBron. Pocket six. And LeBron proves it down hard. The indestructible one. LeBron brushing off contact with the easy deuce. Now here's Beal. He kicks it to O'Neal. Shoots over James. Phoenix no good that time either. Well, this is where he's inconsistent, and that can slow down your team's momentum. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. With his diverse skill set and size, Davis is a matchup nightmare for anyone in the league. Los Angeles shooting their sixth and seventh free throws in the game. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. The first one falls. 80, one of those bigs that shoots well from the line. And the Suns making a change here. Allen's checked in. And so Anthony Davis nails both of them. Well, he's come through for them at the line today, and you love having a big fella who's so capable on his free throw. Morris passes to KD. The shot's good on the assist by Morris. KD's got five points so far. With Durant's size, tough to bother his shot. He either makes it or he doesn't. And it's sent back by Morris. Allen for the three. Rebound the Lakers. Their biggest lead of the game was not to the middle. And it's Davis with the jam. The pass from LeBron moves the ball so well. Now here's Beal, guarded by Reddish. That one's in there. The Lakers lead is cut down to just two points with the bucket from Beal. And that's just a great individual play right through the teeth of the defense. That's good from Davis on the assist by LeBron. He's got 12. I can feel the confidence of Anthony Davis. He feels like no one can stop him right now. Morris outside. Plumley in the high post. Back to Morris. Takes the assist and lays it in. Picked out the pass nicely. Not just swinging the ball around the perimeter. Aggressive move inside. Right on the bucket. And they repeatedly broke inside in the first half, guys, and, and it's paid off. Suns trailed by four. Two minutes remaining in the first half. 158 left in the first half of the game. Back to Beal. Davis with some nice deep. And Los Angeles guys uh, shooting the ball beautifully in the second quarter. They're at 55% for the Phoenix field. Foul. Monte Morris. That's his first personal foul. Third team foul. The Lakers have put up good numbers at the charity strike, converting Number six of seven. Five. Two shots.
Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And the first one drops. Both good from the line that time. There's a minute 40 left in the first half. Outside, Beal. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. James has got his sixth rebound on the night. And again, no good by the Lakers. And so it's Durant with it. He'll bring it up for the Suns. They trail by six. Controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. Plumlee's got his first basket. The hard work and soft hands, guys. That, that's what made that play possible. No simple offensive rebound there. Going for the tip in. And wrestling for it there, but no one has possession. we will have a jump ball. That's a jump ball. The Lakers with the ball. Davis kicks to Reddish. Six on the shot clock. Nice ball movement here by the Lakers. And it's sent back by KD. We all talk about Durant as an elite offensive player, but he also can be a lockdown defender. Forty-four seconds left to play here in the half. You, you almost have to assume he's going to knock those down when he is that open. And that one is good Beal. from Bradley Beal. But even with the contact, Beal does not flinch. James, the bounce pass. With the fadeaway. And that one is hammered home. Doing his job on the glass and doing it with force. And Greg, it's not everybody in the league who can make those kinds of plays. You know, this is one of his specialties, keeping plays alive, creating second chance opportunities. It's Durant on the wing. Over Vanderbilt. And that shot was up in time, but doesn't go in. And some good action through the first two quarters as we reach halftime. Lakers lead by four. It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Thanks very much, Kevin. Good battle going on tonight. What has been the approach? Well, we're just trying to pack the paint. Those guys are great. So we're just trying to make them see a few guys, get some deflections, and get some uh, easy passes. We'll see if he can keep it going in the second half. Thanks. Back to you, Kevin. Thanks so much, David, and we'll step away briefly, but get you right back out here for the start of the third quarter after this break. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, everybody. Good to see you back here on our halftime show. Well, actually, we can't see you, but you can see us, but you get it. Ernie Johnson, Kenny the Jet Smith, Shaquille O'Neal. You're watching the NBA on 2K Sports. A tremendous game we're seeing from Anthony Davis. He had 12 points, two steals, and nine rebounds. And let's get your thoughts, Kenny, on the Lakers. Great work on the glass so far. They're hustling and showing more desire than boxing out. That's what they have to do. That's the recipe for success. And over to Jack, what did you think about Phoenix? Well, they've been out of control. Too many turnovers. Clearly, they don't value their possession. They need to refocus. Don't worry about making a highlight. Make the effective play. And that wraps up the halftime show. Third quarter set to begin in just a few.
second half of basketball upon us. We may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game it's been so far. You know, guys, Devin Booker has been exceptional here. Well, we'll find out if they were able to find an, an answer for him over the break. He was scoring with ease in that first half. I think both sides probably adjusted a few things. The key for him is to bring the same level of energy over these last two quarters. And we've got second half action for you. Thus far, a pretty evenly contested game. Suns trail by four at the guard positions. Russell and Reeves down in the block. It's LeBron and Davis. And it's Hachimura in at the three. That's the Laker five. And brilliant play from Booker. Got it away in time before the defense could close. Pass to Hachimura. Davis with it. Back to Hachimura. Six to shoot. Russell from long range. Rebound by the Suns. Morris outside. There's the pass to Jones. Booker outside for the tie. And two free throws coming up. Unable to get that one to go with all the content. That's on LeBron James. Well, they've got to be careful. A big key to beating them is keeping Booker off the line as much as possible. It's his first trip to the line. And, and he buried a bunch of shots from the strike in that last game. And he knocks down the first one. An elite offensive threat. Booker continues to try and find ways to improve his game. The Suns making a switch here. Beals checked in. That one drops. He ties it up. I'll tell you, he doesn't give points away. Excellent job from the line. Russell inside, working on Jones, and it's Russell missing. Phoenix has gotten a lot of looks from outside tonight, 5 of 12. Booker dishes to Beal. Russell against Jones for the lead. That shot is off. Nice deal from Russell. Here's James. LeBron finishes inside with authority. LeBron is playing well. The ageless wonder. Jones against Russell. Jones the best to KD over James. And KD the bucket on the assist by Jones. Jones has got four assists in the game. Loads it up for Davis. And that's out of bounds. The Lakers will retain possession. Well, you love the pressure he's putting on them. Almost had that steal. Fantastic anticipation. He has active hands. Even though he doesn't come away with the turnover, he's disrupting their offensive flow. On defense, the Suns. They've only allowed two points so far here in the second half. Hits it from three-point range. Hachimura has got 11 points. Just solid with the jump shot. Hachimura helps your offense in a number of ways. In that case, spacing the floor. Here's Jones, and Davis sends it back. And for the ball out of bounds, Davis touched it last. Second half of play with just under two and a half minutes gone. Lock at six. Here's Jones. The nasty streak is coming out for Anthony Davis. Taking pride on the defensive end. And the Suns call time. And as fans and broadcasters, we're not permitted to hear the specifics in these huddles. No, we're left to infer from the adjustments we see on the floor. Down. 
just over two and a half minutes gone by here in the second half. Los Angeles leading by three to the inside. James. Out to Russell. Let's the three fly. Rebound by Nurkic. Nurkic has got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Time now to turn to our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David. Thank you, Kevin. The transfer of the Phoenix Suns last season to new ownership ended a tumultuous chapter for the team and for the league. The new leadership aggressively made the trade for Kevin Durant last year and for Bradley Beal this summer. It's a great roster, and the Suns' $4 billion sales price reflects the sense that this Phoenix market is one of the sleeping giants in the NBA. Kevin? Oh, I agree. On the rise, David, thanks. James with the bucket. Way back there. I mean, LeBron's just showing off now. Booker the best to Nurkic. Back to Booker. He feeds it to Nurkic. It's stolen. Here's Reeves. He's covered by Beal. Here's Davis, and he makes the bucket, gets the whistle, and now a three-point play chance here for him. Rebounding one skill we knew would transfer when AD went from college to the pros. On the night, he's gone two for two at the strike. Yeah, look back at his numbers from the free throw line last year. 78%, so not too bad. Anthony Davis. That one misses for Davis. And so Booker will bring it up for the Suns. Eight-point game. Here's Jones. Battles through traffic and lays it in. Jones has got 12 points in the game. Well, you like how aggressive he is making a play at the rim against Glenn. And let's forget the height disadvantage. He brings the effort and he brings the energy. KD against LeBron over Durant, and it's sent back by KD. Rebound by Nurkic. And that's one way to end up in the highlights. You know what we call this play? A dumb play all the way around, especially at this particular time. Booker outside. Shoots over Hachimura. Goes back up. The shot by KD. No good. And his pure defensive effort changed that shot from an easy one to a tough. And you know, technically, it's a high percentage look. But this is why we play the game. Jones against Russell. Beal, that's for two. From the top of the key, he buries it. He has seven. And this is Beal's role. He's out here to score the ball. And he does it at a high rate. Los Angeles calls timeout. In addition to going over the game plan and making whatever necessary adjustments have to be made, Greg, this timeout also the time for players to get rehydrated or hydrate for the first time with some Gatorade. Plenty of basketball still to be played here, and they have to get recharged. That's a great point. Without proper hydration, a player can completely run out of gas down the stretch of a, of a game. And that's something that none of these guys can afford to have happen. If you're going to battle all the way to the finish, you have got to be hydrated. Davis looking for an opening. Here's Reeves. He's got eight. Trying to break that ice cold streak. Oh, it is good. Now, Booker. Banked in off the glass. Booker's got 23. And we see this so often from Booker because he has the green light to take any shot he wants. Russell against Jones. From outside the arc. Second shot opportunity. Davis down low. He's guarded by Nurkic. Five on the clock. Davis kicks to Hachimura. No good from outside. Got the defender off his feet with the pump fake, but couldn't knock it down. 
defense playing Jones a bit too close that time. Let's take a moment here to get your guys' take on scoring so far for the Lakers. For me, consistent penetration the entire game, and that's given them a lot of options. And also, got to be Take impressed break. with their interior Two play, shot. getting in, in the paint and figuring out ways to score. First free throw is good. What Tyus Jones brings to the floor is energy. He gives it his all when he's out there, and that kind of effort really affects the entire team. And so Jones nails both of them. Lakers leading by four. Russell passes to Hachimura. Now Davis. Lakers working the ball around now. Outside Russell. James has a two-pointer. And it's sent back by KD. Clock at four. Here's Reeves. Good, and the assist goes to James. James has got five assists in the game. This is the shot you want to get him. An open look from range. Hooker the pass to Nurkic. It's stolen by Davis. Here's Hachimura. Rebound by Nurkic. Nurkic has got seven rebounds in the game. And Booker kicks to Jones. Hachimura against Booker. Nurkic trying to get open. Counted, and the Laker lead has been cut down now to just five on the bucket from Durant. And it's fun to watch guys like Booker that see the floor this well. Seems to always get it to the right man. Timeout called the Lakers. All right, fans, if you want a free t-shirt, get up and get wild. And the Lakers with some changes. Vanderbilt comes in for Hachimura. And it's Gabe Vincent in for D'Angelo Russell. And then for Phoenix, Plumlee is checked in for Yusuf Nurkic. O'Neal comes in for Jones. And Grayson Allen subbed in for Beal. Here's Davis. And he goes right over Mason. Plumlee and spins it down. The grace, the athleticism. Most bigs could not have pulled that off. But AD makes it look easy. Booker outside, and Davis sends it back. Out of bounds, Suns ball as Phoenix keeps possession. Duran against Vanderbilt. Over Vanderbilt. KD can't get it to go. And I was sure that was money on that one, but everyone has afforded an easy miss or two. Yes, let's look on the bright side. You got a great look. It's a play that you might want to go back to again. Here's Booker. Buries it down low. Devin Booker. Booker's got eight points here in this quarter. And this is how you convert in transition. Booker running the floor well and being rewarded for it. Vanderbilt finds Vincent. And again, it's the Lakers from deep. He might not have the long range ability of some other guys, but he will knock down open ones like that. Hooker the pass to Plumley. There's O'Neal with the three. And the rejection by LeBron. to Vincent. Pass to Reeves from past the arc. The Lakers keeping it going. A new 14-second shot clock. That one drops for him. Love that they're continuing to attack despite being up big. I'm impressed with their intensity tonight. They have came in focused and they've executed. Now here's Booker defended by Vincent. And it looks like the illegal pick was set. Yep, that's right. That'll get their attention. A 
beyond the leaning, you can see his court. feet weren't set on that screen. Easy call. So difficult to stay planted, especially with all the motion around you. Annoying turnover. A Kogi's check in for Kevin Durant. Here's Vincent, defended by Booker. Pass to Davis. Good for the basket, number nine. He's only missed two shots from the floor all night. AD has added plenty of bustle over the years, which helps him finish through contact. Booker outside. And there's a minute 45 left in the third quarter of the game. Looking to end the run, and the layup is good. Booker's got 27. And showing off a little with the handles there. Man, is Booker fun to watch. Los Angeles leading by 10. Over to the wing. Floats it up for... Here's the lob, and LeBron flies through the air! How do you stop that? LeBron with too much lift and too much power. Booker the bounce pass. Akogi the pass to Plumley. Here's Akogi. James defending. Just five on the clock. They swipe it. Fifty-one seconds left in the third quarter. Pulls up. Vincent misses. And I'm sure next time he sits down, coach is going to have a few choice words for him with that shot selection. And you know what? He knows it. You have to try to play within the system or you're going to come away with empty possessions. Just five to shoot. A Kogi misses. And it's Davis with the ball for the Lakers. The 12 point lead, their biggest of the game. You can't allow LeBron to get into the lane because he's going to punish you for that mistake. Booker outside. It's stolen by Davis. One second left. That shot misses. And so it's LeBron James making things happen for the Los Angeles Lakers. Between his points and his rebounds, he was a star for him in that quarter. We'll get right back to the action when we return. And a chance right now to show you our State Farm assist of the game. And I'm glad this was the pick because I love this pass. Such a great dish. That's what I call court vision. Yeah, you also have the location of the pass. Puts it right where it needs to be, where his man can do something with it. And one quarter to go in a game that to this point has not been an evenly fought contest. On the court for the Suns, we've gotten a zero little. Publi out there with O'Neal. Then there's Monte Game Morris. Center. And it's a Kogi in at the two-guard spot. And that's a special play coming from the one spot. You know, his passing can take a backseat for that dunk. Wow. It just shows you the versatility. This guy can do a lot of different things for you. Woo-wee. Wood with the block. Man, an aggressive block there by Wood. He's not going to shy away from competing defensively. Plumlee, no luck. Lakers leading by 16. There's Russell with the three. It's hauled in by the Suns. Plumlee's got seven rebounds in the game. About a minute played here in the fourth quarter. Wood with the block. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by Wood. A three from Morris. A rebound by the Lakers. To the paint. And Russell gets it to go. And the Lakers lead by 18. With the gentle touch inside. Russell really improving as a finisher. Pass to Okogi. Three-pointer. Cans it from downtown. The defense decides to gamble off him. And he cashes in. 
Russell left side. Plumley with some nice D. Suns trail by 15. Morris outside. The pass to a Kogi. Fires for three. The shot's good on the assist by Morris. Morris has got four assists in the game. For Los Angeles, they've gone two of four from the field since we started the final quarter of play. Benson with it. Plumley with the rebound. Once he gets the ball there, you expect him to capitalize. That was a missed opportunity. Here's a Kogi. In the corner, O'Neal with it. Kicks it to Little. A Kogi, the pass to Morris. Down to five on the shot clock. Off the mark, had a chance to trim it to single digits. Lakers leading by 12. Pass to Vincent. Launches a three. A three-pointer is right on target. Vincent's got five points now in the quarter. Already one of the league's more creative assist men. Russell making people around him better. And Morris throws it down. Now that's what I call a momentum changer. Yeah, when you've got a point guard, that kind of spring, no lead is safe. You're totally right. That can be a shot in the arm for them. A spark that turned things around. Little passes to Akogi. And stolen by Russell. And here's the fast break. Russell leading the way. Yep, that one goes. And the Lakers lead by 15. A yeah, multi-dimensional score. Hard to match up with Russell in that kind of space. Morris passes to a Kogi. The shot's good on the assist by Morris. And you can tell he's looking for his shot. He just believes in it. You know why? Success breeds confidence. And he's certainly been successful from there time and time again. And holding it in there, the smoothness, something you've got to love about Russell's game. Little dishes to Morris. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Beautiful call that time up the floor. The hard screen frees him up for the bunny. Here's Vincent. Over Morris. Again, Los Angeles. And here is Morris. Passes it to Plumley. Here's a Kobe. He's guarded by Russell. Laker foul. The end goal Russell. His third personal foul. First team foul. At the line for the Suns, Josh Okogi. Shoot two. First one falls for him. And the Suns here with a different look. Norkic checked in for Plumlee. Kevin Durant comes in for Royce O'Neal. Beals checked in for Little. And Jones subbed in for Monte Morris. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. Los Angeles leading by 12. Down low. Here's Davis. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. It's going to be on Yusuf Nurkic. Strong move by AD. You see why he's been averaging seven to eight free throws a game over the past few seasons. That free throw, no good.
He hits the second from the line. Suns trail by 13. Now here's Jones. Dishes it to Beal. They grab their own miss. And there's the call on James. That's foul number two for him. It's a challenge trying to keep Nurkic off the glass. He is so good at capitalizing on the offensive boards. Kevin Durant. Line delay. At the line delay. good from Durant. Kevin Durant could easily be on the Mount Rushmore of best players in this league when it's all said and done. Outside, Davis floats it up for James. Hammers the alley through. Oh, and the lead gets bigger on a ridiculous offensive sequence. That dunk alone would have been spectacular. Never mind it coming at the end of an alley-oop. Jones finds Nurkic. to a Kogi. Six on the shot clock. A deep three from Durant. No good there, and that would have cut it to single digits. Outside, Davis. LeBron outside. Corners off the mark. And it's Jones with the ball for the Phoenix Suns. Down by 12. And he gets the bucket. Playing from behind right here. Not easy. But he is answering the bell. The reason why is not just scoring. It's the way he's doing it. Efficient. That's what you need at this point in the game. Nurkic with the block. There's the three. Sinks the three-pointer. Three. And the Lakers That's lead by 13. Number four. A late reaction defensively. He quickly takes advantage. Throws their lead. You can't afford to give him space. Those kinds of mistakes have been the story of this game. For three, a Kogi. And Davis pulls it down. Davis has got his 16th rebound on the night. On loads. Can't nail the jump. Yeah, well, he's going to have some explaining to do on the sideline about why he took that shot. Low percentage chance. If it's not there, give up the rock. Trust your teammates. Nice to be in there. I mean, he's got like a sixth sense in terms of where the miss is going to go. That is really a talent. Here's Reeves. How oh, good on the three. Suns trail by 11. Here's a Kogi. Now Jones. And too much time in the lane. They get called for the three-second violation. And it's easy to give up after a play like that. But this team needs to keep fighting. It's just one trip down the court. But you have to have short memory in this league or you won't last long. Los Angeles making a switch here. Hachimura is checked in. And a change for the Suns. Booker's checked in. And the pass to Reeves. The tray. Phoenix grabs the miss. Durant's got his seventh rebound here tonight. Here's Jones. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. Shooting for Phoenix, Tyus Jones at the line for two. Take a break, take a break. Two shots. And the first one drops. And 
And that's good as he hits both of his shots. Lakers leading by nine. And here's James outside. And Durant sends it back. And that one's good by Davis. Letting his mechanics do all the work. AD trusts his shot to get it done. It's Beal on the wing. Back to Booker. And the dunk by Booker. Now that's what I call a momentum changer. Yeah, when you've got a point guard with that kind of spring, no lead is safe. You're totally right. That can be a shot in the arm for them. A spark that turns things around. Wow, wow, he got whacked on that one. Shouldn't be much debate there. At the line for two, number nine. First free throw is good. And so he makes both from the line. And it's the Suns with the ball. A 12-point game. Time and the Suns call time here. Yeah, he needs to tell his guys to just box out with some energy. That, that's basic basketball. They've been lazy on the backboard and have allowed way too many second chance points. And now we present our New Balance Player of the Game, Anthony Davis. And his percentage from the field tonight seems almost made up. I didn't think it was possible to have that kind of success shooting the basketball. You, you need a little bit of luck, a bunch of hard work, and a whole lot of talent. What a connection he has to these fans. They love him here. And the more he has games like this, the deeper that connection gets. Right now, I'd send it over to the sidelines and get a report from David Aldridge. During that break, Frank Vogel had some real words for his team. He tore into his guys. He said, your body language is awful right now. You don't even look like you want to play right now. Should I sub in for you? Where's the drive to win? Guys. Thank you, David. And here's LeBron outside. Out of bounds. He'll go to the Suns. Suns ball. So it's Phoenix now, down by 12. Jones, the pass to Nurkic. And that comes off the assist by Jones. Jones has got six assists now in the game. Can't let Nurk get this close. Even when guarded closely, he's still capable of scoring. And it's Davis with the jam. And the pass there floated it up to the precise spot it needed to be. And no messing around on the finish. He powers it through. And here's Booker from the arc. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. They led by as many as 18 points. Defended by Jones. Feeds to Davis. Shoots over Nurkic, and Davis puts it in. Davis has got 16 here in the second half. Anthony Davis' teammates are looking to get him involved. He is on fire right now. Here's Nurkic. He kicks it to KD. Nurkic trying to get open. At the line for the Suns, Kevin Durant. Two. two shots. And he makes the first.
Both shots good from the strike. 119 left in the fourth quarter. Here's Reeves. The feed to James. Goes up and lays it nice and easy. LeBron's got four points this quarter. And, and so only one team answered the bell tonight, guys. Not a monster blowout by any means, but still a double-digit victory for the Lakers. This is a game where the defense, you know, steal specifically, generating a lot of opportunities. And, and it created possessions for them, scoring opportunities, and that effort a big part of what will be a nice victory here tonight. And, you know, when you look at the huge impact he had, just a monster game for Anthony Davis. Boy, such a big factor in the game tonight. His intensity on the board. Even when guys put a body on him, he somehow still beats him to the ball. And it's just competing. You know, giving your best when it matters most. It's called killer instinct. It's one thing to be close at the end. It's another to finish. Both teams running perimeter-oriented plays that are working. How often do we see this these days? Clubs answering each other from range. Here's Reeves. So it's Los Angeles winning this one easy. Some good competition with the hometown advantage and their ability to stay focused, I think, made the difference. Yeah, and the first step to becoming a good team is your ability to win at home. And they really seem to revel in that opportunity. And this is what 